Sex talks about apps. Uh huh. Hello everyone, Dalek Sex speaking, at the voice of sex on Twitter if you want to come and get in my pants. Uh, this is Sex Plays uh, Steppy Pants. There we are, Steppy Pants. Uh, it's it's a very simple game, bit like, uh... What was, what was the one I went absolutely fucking tonto playing when I was working for the games cast? Uh, Daddy Long Legs, that was it. Oh good, got a special delivery. Um, this has been out on Android for about a week, and, oh no, don't want to do that. It's been out on Android for about a week, and I intended to cover it on launch day, but I'm just not terribly infused about this one. I was intending to leave it completely, and then a uh, regular viewer, Mrs. Bunty Hoven, contacted me. And wanted me to do it. I said, look, I've, I've really got, I got nothing to make this video entertaining. I don't particularly like the game. I'm not, I'm not looking at it like Jesus has walked out of it like, uh, like other people who've, who've been playing it are. I don't, I don't see that it's the new Flappy Bird or, or whatever. And uh, she said to me, well, why don't you do it? from the perspective of an outsider looking in. I mean, this is sort of like, you like No Man's Sky. This is, this is like, this is what all of the other people who don't get No Man's Sky feel like, the way what you are feeling now. And I thought, hmm, that, 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 that's pretty valid. I mean, I have been playing a ridiculous amount of No Man's Sky lately. But then, as I was thinking about what to say for this video, I, I kind of started to get it. This this does work if you take it under on the on the context that this is about OCD. This is about this is about mental illness. This is the whole don't step on the cracks thing. And if you have to uh, if you have to cross the road on a zebra crossing, you have to step on the white paint marks. Then, I mean, I can remember doing that as a child. And also, I came up with this thing where I had to be standing behind a parked car where, when um, moving vehicles went past, because there were lasers coming from the hubcaps. And I had to jump if one went past and I wasn't protected by a parked car. And I thought this was just something from my own mad head. And then I read years later, I think it might have been in an Ian Banks novel, of somebody doing exactly the same thing. It freaked me the fuck out. Um, it's actually quite a good test of somebody's mental health, this game, because I played it for some of the girls at my workplace. And one of them was watching me play it, and she actually flinched. She actually did a whole body flinch every time I stepped on the cracks. Oh yeah, and it's addictive as all fucking fuck as well. And so yeah, that's that's my review of Steppy Pants. It is a good game, just because I don't get it. Don't. Don't go thinking it's not a good game. You can see it looks gorgeous. The soundtrack's fantastic. The characters are nice. Gameplay's simple and fun. It's, as I said, very, very addictive. And... Yeah, if you do a bit of thinking about where it's coming from, I think that you'll you'll take a lot away from it. Um, but, you know, regardless of, of, of whether or not you get into it. And it, perchance, will take take a lot away from you too. Specifically your phone when you throw it through the fucking wall. That top score 81 isn't mine by the way. I haven't been playing it that long. I haven't. Fuck you. <laughs>